welcome back to my channel if you're new here. Welcome to the shit show. So in today's video, I am doing the letting the person in front of me decide what I eat for 24 hours little challenge. So we're gonna go ahead and awkwardly ask for the same exact thing that they got. I think you guys know, I don't need to explain how this challenge goes. I'm just gonna drive through places and let the person in front of me decide what I'm getting for today. I'm really nervous. <laughs> My heart's beating really fast. I get the same thing from Starbucks every single time. I hate coffee. Well, okay, I don't prefer it. Welcome to Starbucks for the gift for you. Hi, can I get whatever the person in front of me just got? Sure. The exact same thing? Yes. All right, and what else for you? That'll be it. All right, we'll see you at the window. Thank you. Okay, she didn't tell me what it was. If it was a drink, if it was food, or what the price was. She didn't even ask any questions. She was just like, oh, you want the same exact thing? Okay. I really hope that this person got food because I'm a little bit hungry. Um, it's only like 11 o'clock right now. Feeling like a good Starbucks drink and breakfast, but we'll see what happens. Four cars behind me. I could have had so much. Oh, she could have me something great. Oh, I think there's like two cars back there. There's two people in the truck. They're taking a long time, so I'm really curious to see. I haven't seen anything come out yet. Oh, here we go, here we go. We got some food, yay! Okay, oh my god, I am so excited. This is so awkward though. Awesome, love that for me. I'm so fucking nervous. <laughs> I'm like sweating. The good thing that we have a sponsor for today's video. Okay, we're pulling up though and it's our turn, so let me get back to that sponsor in just a second. Hey, Hi. 874. And it'll be right up for you. Perfect. I wonder what food item we got. Like maybe it's a croissant, I'm hoping it's a croissant. Alright, there you are, Thank you. Now, I've talked about Scentbird before, but if you did not know, Scentbird is a monthly subscription service that allows you to sample from over 600 brands of cosmetics, fragrances, and skincare. So, Scentbird lets you choose a new designer fragrance every month for just $15, which is amazing because the normal price for a fragrance runs from about $50 to $100. Now, with your subscription, you get a 30 day supply, which is around 120 to 140 sprays of your fragrance, which is way more than you get in a store size product. And if you want to, you can upgrade to get two to three products a month instead of one. Scentbird partners with the top brands, so you can ensure that you're getting 100% authentic, amazing product. They work with Tom Ford, Prada, Gucci, Glossier, and so many more. So this month I tried Wild Poppy by Nest, Full Bloom Blush by Kate Spade, and another Anna Sui perfume. These are so sick because all you have to do is twist them up and spray yourself. And you... Ooh, that's the Anna Sui one, that one smells. So what's really neat about these little perfumes, besides the fact that they come in adorable colors, is all you have to do if you want to take them out or refill them, twist them up and listen for that little lock and then you just listen for the lock and pull them out and then you have your little perfume and then you can take it off refill it with something else if you want to or go grab a full size and fill it back up and there you go you're good to go to travel so if you'd like to try out Simbird, of course i'll have a link down in the description and use my code kf30 for 30 percent off your first perfume which means you'll get your first perfume for only ten dollars what a steal, right? But let's go ahead and get back into the video. So we are on our first, there's someone staring at me, <laughs> it's totally fine. So we're on our first meal of the day. We went to Starbucks. As you guys know, I get the tanner drink every time, so I never get coffee. And we have a little coffee here today. This looks very sweet cream and sugar filled, which is not my taking for my preference of my tummy. I am highly lactose intolerant, so um, can't wait to shit this out in like five minutes. It like doesn't even t like I know there's coffee in there, but it really like it tastes like someone took half a shot of espresso and then two cups of milk and then called it a coffee. So she got a grande iced coffee with milk, classic syrup with cream. I literally feel like a toddler at drinking out of a sippy cup or like breast milk or chocolate milk or something because this is so watered. This. It honestly tastes like chocolate milk. Yeah, that's milk. That is for, okay, thank you for my milk. Now let's see what she got to eat. I heard them say, here are your egg bites. Now, <sighs> I've never heard, oh dear fuck. So today we have, the coloring is beautiful by Tarte and, oh shit, no! Thank God, now I don't have to eat one of them, that works. Okay, so we dropped one on the floor, we have one casualty, oh my God. 
it feels like it feels like a week old quiche or crab cake or just it doesn't seem like it should be ingested in my body let's go for it I don't, don't want to eat this I really don't huh oh. I don't want I, okay I'm just gonna shove it in my mouth and go for it I really can't do that I really can't do that I really can't do that I really can't do it I really can't do it I Dear God, no, 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 uh uh. I don't like week old eggs. Do you see this? Like, should not go in my body. Like, call corporate type shit. I know you guys probably think I'm being dramatic, but if you follow this channel, you know I'm a very weird eater. I have like internal um, stomach issues and my body doesn't like a lot of things, so I throw up easy. And I want to throw the fuck up right now. Mix that. Starbucks. Yeah, I loved it. Great experience. Now we're gonna move on and get some real food. Okay, so we're at Sonic because I have not been here in a very long time and I thought it'd be fun to do this. Uh, we have a car of two ladies in front of us, so I have the window rolled up so I can't hear them, so it's gonna be a little surprise, but let's see what what they get. By the looks of it, I feel- oh wait, this might be a three-person car. We just had a back window rolled down, off my friends, so- whoa, oh, yep. Yep, it's a three-personer. Yeah, shit, oh, shit, fuck, it's gonna be a big meal. And they're out of town us. So they might be getting a large meal to bulk up before they go back to the beach. Son of a bitch. Hi, can I just get whatever the person in front of me just got? I'm sorry? Can I just get whatever the person in front of me just got? Whatever the person in front of you got? Yeah, everything that they got. Okay, they got... Thank you so much. I am so hungry and they got no fucking food. So, um, I can't wait for snack time. <laughs> I was hoping for like a slushy, you know, a chili cheese dog or ice cream, a blizzard. I don't, you know, something cool, something like very Sonic y, but they got something that I could literally get at fucking McDonald's. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Doing great. 669, you need a carrier? Uh, yes, please. <laughs> The door just keeps like slamming in my face, like mid conversation. I like, have to talk to him. Like, I did it before it closes. Thank you. You're welcome. Let me get your car for you. Okay, let's park and see what we got for lunch. Can I go this way? No? Okay, but we're going to. So, first things. Very <laughs> This is. I love being on a diet. <laughs> My fuck is supposed to do this. Okay. This looks like it's like a yellowish um tea. First things first, my vagina is getting cold because I'm guessing there's a piece of ice down there. I think this is a green tea. Okay, not mad about that. This looks like I think she said cherry coke. I think I know what this one is. Oh, lots of cherry coke. Oh, and then we have one last thing I see over here, my drink holder. One last, oh, okay, one last. Another fucking cup of ice. So for lunch, after having a cup of milk and throwing up eggs for breakfast, we pull over to Sonic and we have two cups of ice and a green tea and cherry coke. Yum, so nutritional, so delicious. I love my life. How does this happen to me? How does every other YouTuber run up a check and like get families of 12 ordering lunch and then I pull up and I get fucking cups of ice? I planned, I told myself, if you spend $300 today, it's fine. Do it for the video, it's great. I'm halfway done with this video and I've spent like, what, $12? See you at dinner. <laughs> Can I get some ranch for this, please? Thank you. Okay, so we just pulled up to Krispy Kreme. Sorry if I look a wreck. I just got done playing tennis for like an hour, but it is snack time and I'm very excited. I haven't been to Krispy Kreme in a couple of years, so let's see what this lady got us. Thank you for choosing Krispy Kreme. How many doses can I get for you today? Can I just have whatever the lady in front of me just ordered? Alright, so you want... Sure, yeah. Anything else? That'll be it. 
Thank you. Oh, here we go. I'm so excited. My first time eating all day. Yes, and it's donuts. How nutritious. <laughs> Thank you. They were laughing. I don't know if she saw me recording or not. Okay, so we just got our Krispy Kreme. Like I said, I have not had Krispy Kreme since my junior year of high school, which was a long time ago. We don't really remember that. Nobody has bought any food that I can eat today yet. So here we are, first meal. It's Krispy Kreme and let's see what she got us. Uh -huh, this my shit. What is it? Can you guys see? Okay, lovely, a great assortment. I'm actually not mad about this. I'm really happy. I'm guessing that she was bringing it home to her kids to be like, sorry, I never take you to soccer practice. Sorry, I go out drinking every weekend, but here's some donuts, right? So we got some glaze, some blueberry, and some sprinkles, and I cannot wait because I have not eaten. Oh dear God. Mmm. Now we're gonna try blueberry. Oh! This is so fucking good. I'm just gonna gargle everything I ever put in my mouth from now on and then maybe it'll go viral on Twitter. What's weird about today is since I've only had like coffee and drinks to put in my body, I'm not that hungry. It's like my body's it's not like starving itself, but like storing old food because it feels like I'm not gonna eat. And now I'm eating all this sugar and I know I'm gonna like shit my pants again in like 10 seconds or throw up, whichever comes first, whichever end decides to up uproar before the other one. But that was my snack time and I guess I'll see you guys at dinner. So it is now at dinner time. We're at our last stop for the day. We came to the beautiful Whataburger to decide. I guess for them to decide what we're gonna eat for dinner. Looks like a man, so hopefully, we've had, a, I think I've had all females today, and all of my females have been little skinny legends, so hopefully, if I'm right and this is a man, he gets some grub. It's a girl. It's definitely a girl. Doesn't seem like she ordered very much. Let's see what she called. Please have food for dinner. Hi, welcome to Whataburger. What can I get for you? Can I just have whatever the girl in front of me just ordered? Oh. Uh Sure. Thank you. How does it work out that every place I go, these people don't want me to eat? Thank you so much. She did not want to have a good day, I'll tell you that much. Okay, so we are on our last meal of the day. I went through Whataburger. I was really hoping I would get behind a man that was like, had a bunch of guys with him or like was getting a bunch of food or something, but I was behind my fourth female of the day and she, again, was a skinny legend. And we got a kid's cheeseburger for dinner. It could be worse. It could be worse. She could have like only gotten a fry, only gotten a drink like we had for lunch. But at least we have something, you know, like it's, you know, not much, but bon appetit. This literally, okay. <laughs> I'm not trying to talk shit because it's my first like meal, meal of the day. But this is literally bread, meat, bread, dinner. Mm. Okay, so obviously this video was a huge fucking fail. Um, for the total breakfast, lunch, snack, and dinner, we spent a total of $27. I'm gonna go ahead and be like, that's the, the highlight of this video. We saved some money today, my friends, but we didn't need anything. We had a cup of ice, two sips of coffee, threw up some eggs, half of a donut, and a very poorly made children's cheeseburger. Congratulations to everyone that spent $400. I almost wish I was you because I'm starving. But I think that concludes this video. If you guys want to see me do this at restaurants so I can actually like spend a lot of money and like eat some good food, let me know. Give this video a thumbs up. And I'll put a little card right here with a poll so you can say yes or no to that video idea. But I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to below if you're not subscribed already. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video where hopefully we actually get to eat or do something. Bye.